everybody, this is Robert Quinlan. And on behalf of the production committee, I'm very excited to announce our 21-22 production season in person. Um, so to start, uh, we'll begin the season with Clifford Odette's play, Waiting for Lefty. This is a seminal work of political theater about a New York City cab strike. And this will be directed by Sanhawish Metianawat. We will move to Westhoff Theater for the beautiful play Bull Rusher by Issa Davis. Bull Rusher is about a young woman who is born with extraordinary abilities. And this play will be directed by Britannia Howe. Moving back to the CPA, we have Good Kids by Naomi Itsuka. Good Kids tells the story of a sexual assault in a small Midwestern town and the impact it has on its citizens. This will be directed by Maria Amenabar Farias. Finally, we have, uh, for theater, we have the play Sueño by Jose Rivera. Um, this is an adaptation of Pedro Calderon's play, uh, Life is a Dream, and it tackles some big ideas, such as uh, what is the nature of honor, what makes a great leader, and what is the line between uh, illusion and reality. This will be directed by Paul Christopher. For dance, we will have an in-person concert in the CPA in the fall, artistic directed by the awesome Darby Wilby. Additionally, here, right here where I'm standing in room 207, we will have two faculty directed shows. In the fall, we will have Love and Information by Carol Churchill. That will be co-directed by Lori Adams and Janet Wilson. And The Downpour by Caitlin Parrish, an intense drama directed by John Tovar. Moving to the spring, we will begin with Ionesco's play, Rhinoceros, which is about the residents of a small village who turn into rhinoceroses. And this is uh, an exploration of themes such as uh, conformity and fascism, and will be directed by Samhawish Metianwat. Next up in the CPA, we will have a title familiar to many, the musical Legally Blonde. And as many of you know, Legally Blonde tells the story of Elle Woods, who defies expectations while remaining true to herself. Back in Westhoff, uh, our current plan is to produce the play Fairview by Jackie Sibley's Drury. And this is a brilliant play about an African-American family who are celebrating a birthday party only to have it interrupted by a group of white interlopers. Uh, this won the Pulitzer Prize in 2019. Um, we do not yet have the rights secured for Fairview, and there are uh, several other places, uh, professional theaters that are interested in it. So we are trying to get the rights. If we do, we will produce Fairview. Um, so stay tuned for more information about that. Um, that production uh, will be directed by Maria Amenabar Farias. And finally, in, for theater in the CPA, we will do Mary Stewart by Friedrich Schiller in a translation by Peter Oswald that ran on Broadway in 2009. This tells the dramatic story of the relationship between Queen Elizabeth I and Mary, Queen of Scots. Dance will be in Westhoff Theater for a more intimate dance concert, in person, artistic directed by Lena Carney. And finally, we will have two additional shows here in 207. The first, John Proctor is the Villain by Kimberly Bellflower, directed by Kelsey Fisher Waits, and The Mine by Marina Carr, an epic Irish tale of love and loss, directed by Connie DeVere. So the process has already begun to design these shows, and we are so excited to produce them here in person next fall. Thanks.